Welcome back to the front porch. Happy Whiskey River Wednesday. Nothing but rain here. Nothing but rain since last week. It's been really nice actually. I need to fix my sprinklers from last fall. And uh, as long as it keeps raining, I can keep putting it off. <laughs> Last week, we talked about my rough week. I shouldn't have spoke when I did. Because not only did our water heater go out, but the very next day, the wonderful children used a thumbtack to draw a farm all over the screen of my TV. I was not happy. Very sad, but try to use it as a teaching moment, and uh, now they know not to climb up onto the uh, TV stand. It could have been much worse. The TV could have fallen. It would have been way worse. It could have gotten real hurt. And so, all things considered, the spank that, spanking that they both got was probably probably all right. And then, Sunday night, our dryer dies. Dunskis. Done. There we go, fella. So, we got a new washer and dryer coming, too. Uh, I'm done. I'm done. Universe, I'm done. Please. Please. Leave me alone. <laughs> Man, that's rough. But birds are happy. <laughs> so that's something. I uh, smoking some one Q out of a Brigham Algonquin 284 2 dot I don't know it was a gift from a member of the pipe club last night we had a May pipe meet the Utah pipe smokers did and this particular member was a manager at some establishment he got held over late and uh had a bunch of pipes he was supposed to deliver to some guys he had made arrangements with and he couldn't make it up there so I went and picked him up for him and he gifted me this little volcano brandy I don't know what it is it's not one that I would ever have bought but it feels pretty good in my hand like the flat bottom there is really nice it just, just sits there so Seems like a good smoker. We'll break it in a little bit more and uh, should be good. So, big thanks there. And tonight, I'm drinking some Fisher Brewing Company, their Kolsch. I picked up, we had our meat last night at the brewery, and I picked up a growler and uh, enjoying a pint of that tonight. Showing up my meager Stanley collection for Tightnet Piper. He he's he's got quite the Stanley stable. So, but they discontinued the Hammer Tone Blue. This I don't know finish. So I'm done. I have my flask. I have my growler. I have my pint. I have my camp mug, and and my big thermos. A big thermos. So covered all the essentials there. <sighs> That's good beer. Good beer.
like I said, last night was our May Utah Pipe Smokers May meeting. It was an organizational meeting and we made a lot of really good progress. There was some good discussion, talked about goals, where we want the club to go, membership criteria, stuff like that. And I volunteered to be in charge of merchandise and advertising. The creative director, if you will. So, I'll have to channel my inner Don Draper and see how we can go. Before with that. I've never actually watched the show, so... Maybe I shouldn't try and channel inner Don, Don Draper just yet. <laughs> maybe I'll have to start watching Mad Men. I know I totally missed the boat and everything there, but if it's on Netflix, I'll give it a shot. Oh, I got a new hat, too. It's a Stetson Explorer. I ordered it in, at the end of March. Because I thought the website had it in stock, and they said, yeah, we do. By in stock, we mean we'll get it made for you. So I had to wait, and it took, they said it would take four weeks, it took six weeks. But I like it. I got it on Monday, and I've worn it every day since. Put my little Aquaman Trident pin on it. It's a replacement for a hat my grandma bought me as soon as I returned home from my Mormon mission when I was 21. That was my fishing hat and camping hat, just all around. And I took fishing last year with my buddy, and we got rained on in the campsite, but we were both pretty drunk. <laughs> and we didn't care, so we were like, whatever, who cares, let's just sit around the campfire, it's great. And we sat around, got soaked until we couldn't take it anymore, and it just warped, just warped the hat real bad, so gave it up to the Goodwill, and got me a new one, and then he got one too, so. I'm going fishing with them on Sunday, and uh, hopefully we can catch a trout. That'd be really nice. I'm going fishing on the Provo River, so hopefully we can have some luck. Anyway, that's really all this week. Whiskey River Piper's house is falling apart, apparently. <laughs> Pipe Club is doing well, and uh, yeah, going fishing, so that should be fun. Got a short little poem for you tonight, from the Pipe and Pouch. It's pretty short, but uh, it's been a long week. <laughs> Two weeks, really. Tobacco, some say, is a potent narcotic that rules half the world in a way quite despotic. So, to punish him well for his wicked and merry tricks, we'll burn him forthwith, as they used to do with heretics. <laughs> well, to that end, I will be burning this tobacco. Hope wherever you are, you're doing well. I appreciate you coming by and stopping by the front porch and enjoying a pipe and a brew with me. And as always, let those smoke now who never smoked before, and those who always smoked, now smoke the more.